my name is my name is Keisha Carter. I am the organizer of Entrepreneurs International Network, and I'm super excited for having an amazing speaker for today, Iman Aghai. So Iman will discuss about the all-in-one tool entrepreneurs should use to boost their impact and income. But before Iman comes to our virtual stage to talk about all the all-in-one tool, we want to talk about what Entrepreneurs International Network is and how you can get the most out of everything that EIN offers. So first and foremost, uh, Entrepreneurs International Network is an organization that helps entrepreneurs to find free or inexpensive education that can help them to network and grow their entire business. So in every single event that we have, we'll have education and networking sessions during our Q&As and gratitude circle where you can find your potential joint venture partners and clients and we also have an app upcoming but we will let you know further about that later on and if you go to our official website eintalks.com you will be able to see the recording of all the past events that we've had plus you will be able to take a peek on our upcoming events and register there so i highly recommend that you download our app and visit our website once our app will be available of course so that you can get access to all the information that i just shared so today's event will run for two hours and we'll have our speaker give us talk for 45 minutes and uh, you will receive a private chat reminders of the time left for your talk. Then after that, we'll have a 15-minute Q&A portion by the audience. And uh, lastly, we'll give another 15 minutes for our audience to share their takeaways and their gratitude to our speaker. And after that, we'll be wrapping up and close the event by 5.30 p.m. Pacific. And with that, let's go to our amazing speaker for today. Iman Aghai. So Iman Aghai is a serial entrepreneur, international speaker, and number one best-selling author. So he is best known as the founder of Success Road Academy and has created over 50 courses that has helped coaches, authors, speakers, and entrepreneurs grow their business aligned with their life's purpose. And so I'm more than happy to have Iman on our stage to share with us his amazing talk and how we can benefit from the all-in-one tool in our business. Iman, the virtual stage is all yours. Thank you very much, Keisha. It's awesome to be here. Well, before I get started, first I want to ask everyone, how's everybody doing? And let's get you guys go to the chat box and tell us where you are from and what it is that you're working on, what project, what business that you're working on. Uh, we did a little bit of pre-event networking and kind of get some people to introduce themselves, but I know that some people are muted and uh, couldn't, you know, chat and talk. So it would be good to get everyone go to the chat box and introduce yourself as well. Also, I want to uh, highlight Keisha's work for today because this is the very first event that Keisha is emceeing for Entrepreneurs International Network. Uh, we started EIN back in 2010, and back then it was called the Vancouver Business Network. And I started running it, and then after me, Roger Killen ran uh, uh, the events for several years, and then we went to COVID. And then Roger retired, and then um, Keisha came on board a few uh, months ago. And this is the very first comeback of Entrepreneurs International Network after uh, about nine months being dormant. So just the fact that we have more than two attendees, that would be me and Keisha, I am impressed that uh, still the group is here and active and we have members. Um, and I want to um, acknowledge Keisha for her work, for uh preparing all the foundation and the technology in the back end so people can actually go and register online and then show up on um on this zoom call with us so that's actually super great and uh your participant would be appreciated if you guys use the chat box to also let us know like what this is that you are doing and uh, and sharing with us so the reason that we stop people from being able to unmute themselves during the talk it's um, 
simply because sometimes we'll get mistakenly unmuted at the worst time, you know, and uh, then uh, just kind of causes distraction. So during this section, we won't allow people to unmute. And then after that, then of course, we'll allow everyone to unmute and then network and uh, talk and, and do everything else. So today, we want to talk about the ultimate tech tool for entrepreneurs. And um, there are two sections to today's talk. One section is all about, you know, like as an entrepreneur, what are the things that we need to look at when we are uh, uh, when we are choosing a technology for our business? And then the second portion of that is, of course, because I have a company called Action Era, and we have looked at all of these things that an entrepreneur should look at. Uh, I'm going to talk about Action Era as a platform that does all of these things, and uh, we're going to have an uh, like an exclusive invitation for anyone who wants to use Action Era. But generally, the core concept of this talk is all about talking about different aspects, different areas, different ways that you can use technology um, that can uh, majorly impact your business and get you the highest engagement rate and best results uh, uh, from all the work that you are putting out there. And I would really appreciate it actually during this talk, if you have any questions, to go ahead and raise your hand digitally. You can find that raise hand button on the reactions. So if you go on the reactions, you can see the raise hand button. And if you have any questions, uh, particular about yourself or anything else that came up during the talk, feel free to go on the reactions, click raise hand, and I'm happy to answer any questions as we are going through the presentation. So I'm looking under the uh, chat box. So I see Sandra uh, is from Vancouver, BC. She helps create uh, free businesses with content and other marketing related services. And uh, she also helps authors and then kind of writing a few promo video scripts and goes writing a book. That's awesome, Sandra. Uh, and then Carmi uh, Carmine is doing well uh, in Kassagar in BC and e-learning startup. And then uh, Kathleen does uh, new to the group, starting a coaching business. Perfect. And then uh, Abed is from Calgary, recently got laid off, exploring new opportunities and connecting with people. Uh, Mary is from Vancouver, and then she helped to defy aging, and uh, Guillermo is uh, from uh, uh, Burnaby, and uh, Executive Agile Coach, and uh, also Gideri is from uh, Final Year of uh, Mechatronic Systems Engineering at SFU, so he's also from Vancouver, the Vancouver area, and Connor also is from Vancouver area, so awesome, that's perfect. So. Let's uh, talk about the ultimate all-in-one tool that entrepreneurs can use for their business and marketing and how they can benefit from it to, um, uh, to grow their business. So the first thing is you need to know this, that you're in the right place at the right time. What does that mean? That means if you have never set up any pieces of your technology, and this is just the beginning of your journey for you, this is the right place because you can get a lot of information about what are the things that you need to look for when you are choosing a tech tool. Um, and if you have some pieces of your tech, but you don't feel that they do what they should do, uh, then that is great as well because uh, we can talk about different aspects that you need to make sure that your technology is covering and make sure that you have actually all of that covered in your business. And if you have all your tools uh, set up and all of them are all of them are working, but you're looking for ways to simplify your life, so like it feels like all the tech is working, but like it could actually be easier. Also, you are in the right place at the right time. So I want to see actually which one you belong to. Like, are you number one uh, or number two or number three? Like you have no tech set up whatsoever. And this is the first time that you are actually looking at setting up any tech or you have some pieces, but they don't feel that they do what they should, they are supposed to do or you're number three. So just go to the chat box and give me either a one or a two or a three, right? And um, technically, uh, as you're going there uh, for the uh, in the chat box and you're talking about that, I'll tell you a little bit about Action around about who we are. So we are real life entrepreneurs who have built our businesses from scratch and recognize the need in the market for a company that has the most amazing tool and world-class amazing support. So let me tell you what that means. 
Uh, I've been in my business since 2010. I started my first business when I was 18, right? But I moved to Canada when I was 25 years old in 2009. And then um, I built many businesses ever since. And I'm a real life entrepreneur. I built many businesses from scratch. And one of the biggest challenges that we always felt in the market was we either couldn't find tools that do all the things that we wanted to, to do, or if we could find the tool, we couldn't find, uh, th then the tool didn't have the right support. Like, for example, we would find a tool, the tool was like, oh my God, like this tool is amazing. And it would email their support and they would get back to us like two days later. And then in the meantime, we're all like, okay, like we really, really need to move forward, but then we need this, right? Or they had amazing support, like right? there were, I was working with this company that their support was always like on top of things, we would email them, they would get back to us in an hour or two, but the tool would fail often, right? And then um, at one point it was like, okay, we really need to have a tech company that the tech works, but also has amazing support. like. So in a way, I started Action Era because I was done with this like dance between either bad tech company or bad tech tool, not company, but bad tech tool or bad support. And if that resonates with you, go to the chat box, say that resonates with me. Like you're dealing with that. You're like, okay, the tool is amazing, but the support doesn't work or the support is amazing. The tool doesn't work the way that it's supposed to do, right? If that resonates with you, go to the chat box, let me know that that resonates, right? And my life purpose is, to change the lives of 100 million people before I die. And I got that life purpose because I was on my deathbed before my 27th birthday. I had a massive um, uh, uh, episode of losing blood. I lost about 60% of my blood in about a day. And I ended up on my deathbed and realizing that um, I want to matter before I die. I want to make an impact in the world. And I knew that I'm good with marketing. But I, I just didn't know like what I can do. And so one of the things that I decided to do on my deathbed was if I would get a second chance, I would help entrepreneurs who want to make a massive difference in other people's lives and help them to make that impact in a bigger way, in a massive way. So um, I know that uh, I'm an um, amplifier to all the amazing positive changes that entrepreneurs want to make. So that's why we work with a lot of coaches, authors, speakers, program leaders, people who can make a massive positive difference in the world. And we just educate them on how to make that massive positive impact in a bigger, bigger way. And so during today, of course, I'm gonna talk about tech and different type of techs that you need to deal with. But then, uh, as I said, I'm going to talk to you about Action Era and why Action Era is a, is a greatest platform that I mean like this morning I was talking to somebody and they were talking to me and they were like why would anyone not want action I'm like I know and that's my point <laughs> like and then we're as we're talking about that I'm gonna tell you about uh, all of that and about like how this one tool can make a big difference but before we get started with that let's talk about engagement and let's talk about you as an entrepreneur and what you need the most in your business when it comes to any pieces of your uh, of your business and as your marketing, okay? So as an entrepreneur, I have a question for you. What's the biggest, most important engagement that you need as an entrepreneur in your business? Okay, so where is the one place that you generate the most amount of income in your business go to the chat box and let me know like is it when you share a video on social media and people like it is it when people comment it we will share or or it's something else that happens so let's get you guys go to the chat box and tell me like as an entrepreneur for you where is the biggest place that you generate impact and income for your business okay and um, i want to compare that with what social platforms uh, call engagement, okay? So go to chat box, tell me, like, what's the biggest piece that generates income for you as an entrepreneur, right? So generally, as an entrepreneur, there are three places that we get the biggest return of investment. We get the biggest income generation activities. And the very first piece is, um, is 
give me one second to go to my presentation. The first piece is getting people on your sales page, right? So when you send people to your sales page, when you get people to go and look at your offer, where they click on the button and they're all like, I'm in, they want to pay, they want to pay, they want to buy your services. That's where you generate the biggest impact and you generate the biggest income, right? Because you, you make an impact in the world when people purchase from you and you can actually serve them with your work, right? And then the second thing that you generate the biggest impact and income is when people go to a page to book a call with you. So um, you, you're, you're, let's say, for example, you're a service provider, you're the person that uh, sells uh, coaching programs or done for you services or anything else. And what you need to do is you need to get on the phone and have a one on one conversation with people. So booking that call with you is the place that begins that process of making an impact and also generating income for yourself and the business. And the last place is having people to go to your opt-in pages, webinar registration pages, event pages, and so on and so forth, which is like the greatest place for you to be able to convert people from your social traffic or from your cold traffic or from joint venture traffic to become actual paying customers, okay? However, one of the biggest challenges that people are facing when it comes to uh, the platforms these days is that the majority of the platforms don't want to allow people to leave that platform. So for example, if you are on TikTok, TikTok wants to keep people on TikTok. If you are on Instagram, Instagram loves to keep people on Instagram. If you're on Facebook, Facebook wants to keep people on Facebook. Why? Because they generate money if the user stays on the platform. So if a person leaves Instagram, then Instagram cannot run ads to them. So Instagram won't make money, right? So the way that Instagram works is the way that people want to like, they want to comment, they want to share that Instagram link. But for example, Instagram doesn't allow you to put a link under each video to say, go ahead and book a call. You can have that link to be on your profile, right? But if, for example, you have a call to action on one video and you have another call to action on another video and you have another call to action on another video, then you have to create a book tree or link tree, a link tree in your file, your profile, and then say linking profile. And then people go to link in the profile and then they have to look at like five different links, which decreases your conversion rate, which, but the reason that that happens is because Instagram doesn't want people to leave Instagram, okay? Or Facebook doesn't want, like for example, if you put a link in your post in Facebook, you suddenly get like two people liking it. You put a funny video of a cat, like you get like 200 likes, you post something impactful and life-changing and say, book a free call with me, suddenly you get like two likes. And you're like, what's wrong with people? Why would people like, like the funny cat video, but this thing that changes their lives, like nobody sees and nobody, it it's, has nothing to do with people. Just Facebook doesn't show that post to people because if people see that post, they're gonna click on the link, they're gonna walk away from Facebook and Facebook stops making money. So when you get that link, you put it in the comments, but then now again, uh, Facebook is catching up with that. They're decreasing any of that post. So now they're showing all the relevant comments. And anyway, they're fighting with keeping your audience on their platform. Are there ways to be able to get around it? Of course, but... The reality is that you need to build your platform that allows you to communicate with your customer or with your potential customer on a regular basis without needing to fight with the platform. So your platform should be a platform that can allow you to do this for yourself. And if you don't, if, if it, if, if you don't have that platform, you're constantly fighting with different platforms. And for example, Facebook started like being super amazing with pages and suddenly killed the engagement of pages. TikTok was amazing with certain things and started like not working. And we've known this for years and years that you need to build your own platform. That's why people started having their own blogs. That's why people started having their own mailing lists. That's why people started having all these pieces that would help them 
with uh, with the engagement and with create and with keeping in touch with people. Now, keep this in mind. I'm going to get back to this and about the importance of a platform that allows you to create engagement with your own users on a separate piece. Okay. Now, on another part, you also need to make sure that the platform that you are creating for yourself has certain features. And I have a list of these features that uh, you want to look at and you're like, yeah, you know what? I need actually some of these lists, some of these features, some of them you may not need, some of them you may need, right? But generally these features are divided between two sections, marketing features and content delivery features. So under marketing features, you want to make sure that the platform that you have allows you to build funnels. So what are funnels? Funnels are pages that are specifically designed for taking certain action that after people take that action, it goes to the next page of the funnel and the last person to take another action. For example, a webinar registration funnel, there is a webinar opt-in, people opt into that, then they go to the thank you page. Then they go on the thank you page, they get all the details of that. So that's a webinar registration funnel, right? So you want to make sure that your, your platform allows you to build funnels. Number two, you want to make sure that your platform allows you to build the websites, websites that where you can have your blogs on it, where you can have your about us, where it has, like we call it, corporate looking website, like that has your about us, that has your blog, that has your all the other things, all your content marketing, all the all the like all the features like if you have upcoming events list of all the upcoming events that you have and all those type of things you want to have a platform that allows you to have a mailing list now sometimes you have these as separate platform for example for funnels sometimes people go and buy click funnels and for websites they set up a wordpress website and for mailing list they get a tool like active campaign or aweber or you know mailchimp so they use like different tools and sometimes they try to get one tool the problem is that there are not lots of tools out there that actually does all of these things right so you want to have a mailing list where you can email your people you want to have an affiliate tracking platform where it tracks the affiliates who referred clients to you, who is sending opt-ins to you, who's sending all of those types. You need to have a system to book appointments. So many of us have calendar links. So Calendly, Acuity Scheduling, all those type of things that allow people to book an appointment with you. You want to have a system that allows you to send text messages. For example, we have an event called Collaborate that when we send text messages to our past participants to go and register, Suddenly we got like 150 to 200 people register. But when we send an email, like out of five emails, we make get 100 registrants. Out of two text messages, we get 150 to 200 registrants. That's massive. That's massive. Of course, those people have said they allowed us to text message them, right? They've opted into text messages. But like that's a massive number, that massive difference. Like two text messages outperform five emails right? So that's a great thing that your system needs to allow you to do. And of course, tracking phone calls. So when you when you make a phone call, like you will be able to, you track like, okay, I made a phone call to this person, I made a phone call to this person. So you need to have a platform that allows you to do all of these under marketing. And you need to think about these. And also when it comes to content, your platforms allow you to have membership uh, capabilities, meaning that says, for example, this person is a free member and this person is a paid member, or this person has purchased these two courses or has purchased these two things. So has a history of what that member has done with you. So automatically allows you to control the access to that user based on the level of membership that they have or based on the different type of things they've purchased from you in the past, right? So the, it has to have that membership capabilities. And with that membership capabilities, it should allow people to get access to different courses that you have. If you sell courses, if you do summits, allow them summits. If you do podcasts, you should have a platform that allow people to get access to those podcasts all in one platform. If you do events, can have a list of all those events coming up. If you are giving them a list of directories, then list of those directories, interactive lists. And you're looking at all of this and you're like, Iman, wait a second. Those are like a lot of tools, dude. And I know. 
And I know, right? And that's why the tech tools have become so complicated to deal with. Because in today's market, like if you have a podcast and if you have a YouTube show and you have your shorts, uh, you have your TikTok videos or YouTube shorts, and at the same time, you're selling a course, and then you need to have a funnel to register people to your webinar. Like all of this is like, oh my God, the amount of tools that you need and also the technology and the support and all of these things and all of these things add up in costs. Later on in the presentation, I have actually a table of all the expenses and all the different tools that a person can purchase. And like the monthly cost of it comes about like $959 or something like that a month if a person wants to have all these features. And the problem is that all of them should even should, should also talk to each other, which the majority of them don't. And then we wonder why people have tech issues. Well, no wonder everybody has tech issues. And then we, we end up settling for whatever we can get. If that resonates with you, go to the chat box, Iman, I'm with you. If you're following what I'm saying, right? If you, if you have experienced this, if you have, if, if what I'm telling you, it actually makes sense. You're like, okay, Iman, this makes sense. I'm following you. Yes, I get it. These are the features that, that the tool needs to have. I get it. I understand it, right? But then I wish it would end here because there was also the question of accessibility. What do I mean by accessibility? Here's what I mean. When you have a tool, of course, that tool should allow people to get access to your funnels and systems and pages and websites and your content on the web. But it also should be a mo should should work on a mobile friendly browser. So what I mean by that is like, for example, if somebody is using an iPhone and is checking everything on Safari, if I load your website on my Safari, I should be able to see your website looking good on my Safari as well. But this is where a majority of tools stop. The majority of tools go to web and mobile friendly browser view. But they are falling short on allowing you to have your own branded iOS or Android app. And this is what the majority of entrepreneurs don't realize because the tools don't offer it. And because the tools don't offer it, it just never comes to the mind of an entrepreneur. But let me tell you about the importance of having your branded dynamic app. So what does that mean, branded dynamic app? Branded dynamic app means a branded app is an app where you can go to Google Play or you can go to Apple Store to, uh, to App Store, and on App Store and on Google Play, you can search for my business. You can, for example, you can go to App Store right now and search for Iman Agai. And you can download Iman Agai's app. That's my branded app, okay? Or you can go to one of our clients, uh, uh, like you can go to App Store and like download one of our clients' app, right? So, that's a branded app and the dynamic app, meaning that I can change the content of my app any second that I want. What's the importance of that is that I can launch an app really fast. And if, for example, today's content gets recorded, we can immediately update, uh, uh, update it on the app tomorrow without needing to update the entire platform. Okay, so the content of the app can be updated, which is called the dynamic app. So what's the importance of having your own app? This is the importance. The engagement of the old platforms the, or the previous platforms we used to use are decreasing drastically. Since the pandemic, mailing list open rates have decreased significantly. So if you were used, you used to get like 20, 30, 40% open rate to your mailing list, most likely you're getting 10, 15, 20%. So you're seeing about like 25 to 30% decrease of open rate on mailing list. And yet at the same time, and worse than that, 
is you are seeing the click-through rate on emails have decreased even worse. So if you are getting like 3%, 4%, 5% click-through rate, now you're looking at half a percent, 1%, 2% click-through rate. Th that's an awful number and I'm gonna get there. I'm gonna actually show you like visually what that means. And engagement with blog posts and written content has decreased significantly and have been decreasing significantly for years. It's been years and years that they were the same. People are moving to video content. So blogs are not necessarily the answer to keep up with the demand of where the market goes. So the majority of the market is consuming short videos. I'm going to actually share that with you. And they are consuming it on their, on their cell phones. I'm going to share that with you number, right? And many experts are experiencing lower show up rates on their webinars, on their summits, everything else. And when you look at the research and the surveys that we are doing in the market, we see that North American adults are reporting that they are spending between one to three hours a day educating themselves. So wait. North American adults are spending between one to three hours a day educating themselves, but they are not opening emails. They're not clicking on the emails. They're not showing up summits. They're not showing up on webinars. These were all the platforms that we built to work with them. But so where did they go? Where did they go? If they were spending one to three hours a day educating themselves, but they are not on all the platforms that we built, where are they? So here's where they are. They report that they report that sixty-five percent of them want to spend their time on apps and study your content on an app. And there are seven billion users that are using apps today. Seven billion users that are using smartphones. There are more smartphones out there in the world than we have computers in the world. 7 billion smartphones are out there where people are preparing to use their smartphones and use an app to get their content. That's why Tony Robbins has his own app. That's why so many other people have built their own app because they know that that's where people prefer to study their content. Now, one of the benefits of the app is increased engagement through push notification. So what's a push notification? If you look at here in this picture, you see this thing, the notification that shows up. So when a person comments on something, you see a comment like so-and-so commented on your post, so-and-so comment, right? So like this app just published this. This push notification has replaced the engagement that emails were getting. But by what percentage, this is the difference. On the email marketing, on a regular standard website, we are getting about 5% opt-in rate. On a funnel, we are getting about average of 55% opt-in. Of course, we have some funnels that get 92% opt-in rate, and we have some funnels that get like 30% opt-in rate, but the average of a funnel opt-in rate is about 55%. We're getting between 5 to 55% on email marketing. We're getting 80% subscription to push notification. So 80% of people who download your app subscribe to get push notifications. Now, the second piece. We're getting an average of 20% open rate on email marketing, and we are getting an average of 90% open rate on push marketing. So when you send a push notification through your app, 90% of people actually see it, click on it to see what it is. And this is where push notification significantly outperforms emails. We are seeing about 2% click-through rate on emails, while we are seeing 25 to 40% click-through rate in the first hour that the push notification is sent. So just think about this. If you have 10,000 people on your email list and you send an email about a video, 
200 people click on the link to watch that video. So 10,000 people list, 200 of them click on that video. If you only have a thousand people on your push notification, you get about 320 of them click on that push notification to watch your video on your app. That's 16 times higher engagement. When you are using your own app, to communicate with your own users. Now, how would that impact you? If this increased engagement could get you an extra one or two high paying clients a month. Let me explain this. Imagine that you are, you, you like think about your business and you're doing a done for you service, right? And you record this short video, like seven, eight minute video, where you educate people. And then at the end of that video, you say, if you don't have a mentor who can take your hand and walk you every step of the way, go down below and book a call with me to see if one of my mentorship programs can help you. And you send that email to your mailing list. And if you have a thousand people on your mailing list, only 20 people watch that video. And if 1% of that 20 people click, that's like no one, like 1% out of 20. That's like 0.2%. But if you send that to 1,000 people on a push notification, 320 of them watch that video. And if only 1% of those people apply, that's three applications that week. It's not that what you offer is not working or is not engaging with people. It's the platform, the way that you're using it, it just stops you. It, it just, there, there's a big difference between having 320 people click on a link and only 20 people <laughs> clicking on the link. Like it just, that difference is massive. And it's just a platform it has nothing to do with that video, has nothing to do with your engagement, has nothing to do with your, with like how awesome you are or how great your message is. It has to do with the way that people are engaging. Now, if you put that video on TikTok, that's great, except that now those people, if they go to the next video, they may see a competitor's video, or now they may see another video that they're interested in and it gets distracted. So when you have your own app, when they watch one of your videos, the next video is yours. The next video is yours. The next video is yours, right? So every single thing you do on your app is yours. Massive difference to all of those pieces, right? So if that collects with you, go to the chat box, say, okay, I, I might understand it. And by the way, I understand like, building apps might seem very complicated, right? So I get it, right? But I want to tell you, just show you the possibilities that a platform should have. And many people are not taking advantage of it just because their platform doesn't allow them to do it. And when your platform doesn't allow to do this, right? That makes a big, big difference, right? So Carmine is asking a really good question in the chat box said, so how do you get clients to download your app? Actually, you get clients to download your app exactly with your current specific, current marketing strategies that you have. So let's say, for example, you have an opt-in page, okay, for your business. When people opt in to download that PDF in the first email that you send to people, you say, thank you very much for requesting that to download this report. I highly recommend to you to also download my app to get access to these extra bonuses. Here is the link to my app on App Store. Here is the link to my app on Android. P.S. Here is the link to the PDF you requested. So you get people to download the app within your existing marketing strategies. You don't need to do anything extra. And 
Also, when people download, for example, opting to download your uh, GIF, download your PDF, download anything else, on the next page, you say, hey, thank you very much for requesting to download, download my app, and you get extra bonuses. So they're just, you add that to your signature of all of your emails. You add that to all the emails that go out. And here's one thing that you can do. There, there, oh, by the way, there are so many strategies on, on top of all of this, right? But you also, for example, let's say you do videos on TikTok. Like, so in no shape or form, by the way, I'm saying don't do TikTok, don't do Facebook, don't do Instagram. But when you have your own app, you can have a call to action that goes to get people to download your app. And the link on your profile can be download your app link. So one link. So for example, I teach people something. And I say, by the way, download my app from the link in the profile to get access to extra content. Download my app on the profile. So everything I say in Facebook, in TikTok, in Instagram goes, go to my profile and download my app. Now I am building my platform. And when people have my platform, in their pocket, I can send them a push notification. I can say, hey, here is a new education. At the end of that education, I can send them to my book a call with me. I can send them a new education, invite them to a webinar. I can send them an education, I can send. So this is your TikTok, that the only person's content is you. This is your Facebook. This is your, this is your app. And that's the difference, right? Now, Within the app, you can have a lot of extra features. You can have a lot of extra features. For example, one of the features, uh, I, I'm going to get there. I'm actually going to get there. Like, what are the things that you can do with this, right? So beside everything that we talked about, so that your platform should allow you to build your funnels, to build your websites, to build your marketing, to build all of those things, your platform needs to also allow you to have your branded dynamic app. Now, you remember I talked about a, a table that will look at all the expenses. So here is a table of all the tools that you kind of need one way or another to get for your business. You need probably a CRM or a pipeline management system like HubSpot or like PipeDrive, or you need to have an unlimited sales funnel system, which is like click funnels or you know, lots of other tools, right? Website builder like WordPress, surveys and forms, email marketing, two-way SMS marketing, uh, booking appointments like Calendly or Acuity scheduling, uh, workflow and automations, affiliate tracking, right? Call tracking, and so on and so forth. So remember that I talked about like all these costs adding up, and this is not even including the app, because the app part alone can cost anywhere from $2.99 a month all the way to like hundreds of thousands of dollars, right? Now, of course, I'm telling you this because ActionAir does all of these things in an unlimited way. So it gives you unlimited emails, unlimited websites, unlimited funnels, unlimited all of these pieces. Plus, it allows you to build courses, summits, directories, membership platforms, events, podcasts, interactive lists, and so on and so forth, okay? So let me share with you a couple of case studies of people on how people are using their apps. But of course, everybody knows what funnels are and what systems are, what mailing lists is and everything else. So I'm not going to actually showcase any of those things because all of us know what those things are, right? But a couple of cases that I'd like to share with you. One, I'd like to share with you a case study on how to use your content to nurture your list and generate high value leads. Number two, show you how to use a feature called action lists for creating daily engagement and accountability. And number three, show you a system for creating action directories, which allow you to get joint venture partners and get those joint venture partners to get people to download your app because that's one of the biggest winning things that we want to have, right? We want people to be able to download your app so you get more users on the app, right? So I'm gonna share my screen with you here. 
I'm going to showcase actually three of the apps of our clients with you and uh, show you how these people are using their Action Era app to be able to um, uh, to market their business and how it actually has changed their business. Okay. By the way, does anyone have any questions so far? Are you guys getting value? Are you getting getting some stuff here, like in terms of the in terms of like the tools, different things that tools need to do, all those pieces. So, let's say for example the, on the content marketing. So, if you look at that, you, do you see that Iman Agai app? So that Iman Agai app is my branded app, right? So that's that's a that's my branded app. And you can download it from App Store. You can download it from Google Play. And when you download that app, then you get a, you get a registration request for a push notification. And when people subscribe to my push notifications, every time that I share a new video, they get this video notification that then they can go to my app and they can watch my video. And when they watch my video, at the end of my video, I may say, go down below and register for our upcoming training. Or I say, go down below and book a free schedule, book a free call with us as a mentor. Or I send them to a sales page. At the bottom, do you see where it says, get my free training? That's a call to action. On every page, I can send people to the specific call to action that I want. So this is not like TikTok or Instagram where I'm limited to the number of call to actions that I have. This is my own platform. So I can send people to anywhere that I want and no one cares because it's my own platform. So I'm getting 16 times higher engagement with my own app comparing to if I had this on a mailing list. Now, what that means is that I can nurture my own connections through my app and I can use my mailing list to promote joint venture partners. So today I can promote a joint venture partner on my mailing list while at the same time, I am marketing my own products and services through my own app, right? Now, the other thing is, for example, is using a feature called action list. So under this, we have the GPS to life success. This is another one of our clients. And one of the features that we have is called action list. So if you go to that, you see under action lists, right? And under action list, you can create either recurring lists or you can create a one-off list. So let's say, for example, you have a high-end package where you provide done-for-you services for people, okay? So if you have a high-end package where you provide done-for-you services for people, then you can give them a one-time action list where people get this checklist of all the things they need to do. And anytime they do one of them, they can come here and put a check mark. And if they don't know what that means, there is an arrow here to the right where they can click on it and they can watch a video or text or see an image. <laughs> Sorry. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> so they, see, they can see an image or a video or anything. And then when they learn it, they can implement it and they can go and put a check mark beside everything they do. Now, you can have these action lists on a, on a recurring day-by-day -day basis. So, for example, if you are a nutritionist, if you are a business coach, if you are a business mentor, you can get people to go back to your app every single day and get them to uh, journal, for example, like on like their progress, on how they are moving forward, or all of their goals, and so on and so forth. So there are just so many ways that you can use your app to get people to go back to the app and then interact with the app to be able to work with you and go to the next level, okay? Does this make sense? Is everybody with me, right? Now, uh, Mary is asking in the chat box, can AI help to build our app? So. AI can help you to build the content of your app, but the AI itself cannot build the app. And it's a little bit more than 
just um, build your own app, right? So, um, because the, the, there is a process of developing the app and there is a process of submitting the app to Apple Store and to Android, to Google Play. And that process is a very manual, very kind of a complicated process, which at Action Era, we do it for you. So it's a done for you service that we do for people. So um, that makes a big difference. So I know you guys have been listening to me for the past like 40 minutes and you're like, Iman, this sounds cool and all, you know, but probably this is gonna break the bank. Like I'm gonna spend a lot of money, do it like this is great, cool and all, but probably it's gonna be very expensive, right? And, and you're not wrong, um, kind of. And here is why. If you want to custom develop an app, an app alone, it's going to cost you about $100,000 to $150,000. And there are companies like Mighty Networks that to talk to you, they start at about $30,000 per year to even talk to you, to even consider developing an app for you. So that's kind of very expensive. And there are good companies like BuddyBus that there is a $600 setup fee and they charge $299 a month to help you to have your own app, which is a very good price, but they're WordPress-based. So BuddyBus is a WordPress-based, meaning that you need to build a WordPress website, you need to maintain the WordPress website, and then on top of that, you need to pay the $600 setup fee plus $299, Plus, you will need to have your uh, marketing platform. And, and then so we're just kind of getting back to, again, Frankensteining all your tools because all the tools are now like together again in one platform. You're using different tools, different platforms. That's not what we want to do, right? So Actionera is the only true all-in-one platform in the world that allows you to do everything related to your marketing, to your funnel, to your courses, to your everything. Plus, it allows you to have your own branded mobile app. There is absolutely no other platform out there that allows you to have all of these in one platform. Now, here is the kicker. Usually, you can get Action Era by going to our website at $2.99 a month or $2,990 a year, which kind of makes it the cheapest, the most inexpensive option between all the app platforms that's out there. And remember, all the app platforms don't do any of the funnel systems that I was talking about. And actually it does all of those. And regularly on our website is $2.99 a month or $2,990 a year. But Today, you can also get an exclusive offer and you can get that only at $199 a month or $1,990 a year, okay? So today only, you can get this at a very, very exclusive price. And again, as I said, that's only $199 a month or 1990 a year, and you can get it by going to EIN, that's Entrepreneurs International Network, dot getactionera.com. EIN dot getactionera.com. Okay, so we're going to put that link for you guys in the chat box. And if you go there, you get access to that. You also get 14 days a money back guarantee. So meaning that if you go there, you get the platform, you don't like the platform, you want to get a refund, you can totally ask for a refund. And, and that's totally okay. Like you can get you can get the platform. It's only $199 a month or $19.90 a year. And when you go to that link, I'm also going to include some extra bonuses for you. And so those bonuses are things like you're going to get membership to JV Insider Circle. That's a $997 per year membership, which gives you deal-making calls with potential joint venture partners. It gives you a ticket to a three-day in-person event called JVX in Las Vegas. It gives you three tickets to an event called Collaborate Event, which is a three-day virtual event to find joint venture partners. So it helps you to get traffic 
You also get access to my ultimate course formula, which is a program that teaches you how to create and sell online courses in 60 days or less. That's normally $497 and you get that also as a bonus. We also usually charge $497 to give you action or content companion website, which makes your app available on the web. And you get that also today as a bonus, as part of the discount. And you get stellar, out of this world, amazing support. You cannot possibly find a support team that's as dedicated as we are in our supporting people. And of course, normally we charge for our marketing platform, but you also get our entire marketing platform as a bonus, which means you can build unlimited funnels, unlimited mailing lists, unlimited contacts. You can do affiliate tracking. You can do calendar booking. You can do SMS calls and books and everything else. Now, here's an interesting thing. If you already have a platform and you're happy with it, you can just integrate that to Action Era and just use Action Era for the app portion. But you're done if you're tired with the uh, platforms that you're using and you're just, you just want to switch, you want to find a better deal, you want to save money and you want to get better support, then you can switch to us. And here is the last part of that deal. When you join Action Era today, so this is the first 10 people, of course, we have less than 10 people here on the call. So it means that when you join Action Era today, we are also going to increase your affiliate fee to 50% for the first two people that you refer. So if you refer two clients to Action Era, practically, you're paying nothing for your entire platform. If you reverse third one, you're even making money by using Action Era in your business. So what I'm telling you is you can start at $199 a month, which will save you about $750 a month on all the tools. It gives you every single tool you need, the entire business to you. It also gives you a branded mobile app. And when you refer to clients, it ends up to be practically free because we increase your affiliate fee to 50%. So you pay 199 and you get 50% of two people who are paying 199, which kind of makes your platform entirely for free. And all you need to do is simply go to EIN.getActionArrow.com. Dot com, okay, EIN.getActionArrow.com. Okay, perfect. So with that, um, I hope you guys got good value, at least the very, like all the things that your tech tool should provide you. And uh, if you have any questions, feel free to raise your hand. I am done with the part of my talk. Um, if you have any questions about the platform, uh, feel free to go ahead and raise your hand. Uh, Keisha, you can allow people to also unmute themselves and ask any questions they want. I'm gonna quickly check the chat box to make sure that if any question was asked in the chat box, I haven't, I haven't missed anything. Uh, Kathleen, you're up. Thank you. Yeah, very interesting uh, presentation. My question is on the actual development of the app. So mm -hmm. actually, you mentioned that Action Era would do that for you. So how uh, how is that done? How does it work? That's a great question. So here's how it works. So we have forms for your first version, right? So we give you these forms and the forms have samples. So it says, for example, like we need a title for your first piece of content. So you put the title, you put the video for us, right? And you just fill in this form, it's nine uh, it's nine tabs, and you submit all the pieces that you have. If you don't have them, you can skip them, right? And then we have um, something called PLR. PLR stands for private label rights. So if you don't have certain pieces, you can also use our PLR content for the first app to submit, okay? 
So we submit the first app. We deal with Apple and we deal with uh, uh, Google Play because they're very hard to deal with. You you pass, you prefer, you're like you you don't want to do that. Okay, we will deal with them, and then we'll get your app launched. When we get your app launched, your app is dynamic, so you can go and change it on your own anytime you want, anything you want to do. Okay, perfect. Okay. And we have a great we have a great onboarding team. So you actually talk to an onboarding expert. The onboarding expert is going to talk to you about all of those things, and then um, and then they're going to help you. They're going to explain everything to you, what you need to do, and then they're going to help you. Actually, Keisha uh, Keisha is new to our team. Like she's been on the team for about a couple of months, and she just is launching the Entrepreneurs International Networks app by using the standard system. So um, she just talk to our um, app onboarding experts and she just submitted that nine tabs form that I was talking about. And yeah, it, it, it's, um, yeah, it's it's a very, it's a simple process that you will have a lot of support and our members will help you to do that. Our, our team members will help you to do that. Perfect, thank you. No worries at all. Awesome, great question. Uh, Mary, I know that you said that you have Action Era at the beginning, you said that you bought Action Era several years ago. Is that what you said? I, I did, I got it. E eons of time ago and I've just, oh. signed, up. And I've just oh. signed up again because um, it's time and I've really jumped into it what I, my question was can you repeat I I was talking to my son and of course I had just turned at the time that you were going to talk about AI how mm -hmm. can AI help me um, get it uh, the whole thing that I want now is speed so um, the faster the better um, and I'll work my butt off on mm -hmm. it um, but uh, AI can, can help in some way? Absolutely. So with AI, you can use AI to increase the speed of your content creation. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's, that's sure. the main place, right? But yeah. So the AI can't help you with the coding of it. However, the AI can help you tremendously with content creation. Now, this is just very privately I'm telling you because there are not lots of people on this call, so I can actually tell you this. But um, I'm actually working on a AI content planner. I'm hoping to be able to launch this privately to Action Era users. We're not promising it yet because I'm talking to the developers, but we probably are going to, if we can, we're going to uh, also launch that to Action Era users to be able to have an AI content planner for themselves. Well, I mean, you know, um, chat GPT, given the right prompts, and of course that we, have learned it's all about the prompts, folks. It's all about the prompts. Okay. Um, but um, anyway, um, the content can be put together pretty fast. Um, is it easy to just kind of put it down on paper and shuffle it in as opposed to trying copy to wrestle paste. with all these different forms and stuff that drives me crazy? It's as simple as copy and paste. It's, oh, it's okay. Like, okay. It says, it says copy and paste, like literally says copy and paste. Oh God. So you just copy, you paste, you copy, you paste. Like if you have videos on YouTube, you just get the YouTube link, you paste it there. It, it literally is copy and paste. Awesome. Okay. Sounds good. I'll, I'm excited and uh, I'll be moving forward with this. That's awesome. That's and awesome. I, you know, it was time because I'm struggling with go high level or learn worlds and this that and the other thing and it's like oh my god one more thing one more thing one more thing and you know and i've got my calendly and i've got this other piece and this other piece and it's like oh my god time to get it all together and uh it so obviously i was here for a reason <laughs> Good. So let me tell you actually something because you said go high level. So part of Action Era is go high level. Okay. With, with one difference. When you use go high level directly, you, you, you oh, get no, high so level hard. support. Yeah. When you are using Action Era's go high level, you're getting Action Era support. So uh, the other day, Keisha and I were on the call and like we had a question. The team didn't know this is my company, right? Because I'm multiple companies, right? So the team didn't know this is my company. And and I asked Keisha, I said, Keisha, just ask the support. So there is a chat box that we have. And Keisha clicked on the chat box. She posted it. The second she posted it, the team read it and responded to it. Like it didn't take even 10 seconds for the team to see it. Wow. And like they responded to like that level of support 
is what Action Era provides. It's the it's the level of support. It's not it's not just the tool. It's the tool mixed with the support. Awesome, awesome. Okay. So yeah, so we we are. Um, I mean, our um, our support satisfaction rate is like four point eight out of five. That's like unheard of for it's when it comes to tech companies because in tech companies every day is like oh my god like I'm pulling my hair and I can't find but and then every time we go anywhere and in, in the chat box and when people have that are there with us they're like oh my god this was the best tool like I can't believe like how good your support is and everything else anyway I'm looking forward to it and it's definitely time and awesome. the price was definitely right so thank you awesome awesome so this is so this app is just an app to connect to what you have right now. We we still as a business we still need to put together our uh, our website and our e-commerce um, e-commerce infrastructure um, as well as our shopping shopping page or or whatever Shopify or whatever it is, right? So, uh, so you won't need Shopify anymore. You won't, need, you won't need any tools, but you need to, but you will need to use ActionEra to build all of those pages for yourself. So you, you will need a website, but ActionEra can build a website as long as you want to build it. So you don't need to buy those tools, but you just need to build it within ActionEra. And then our team can help you and guide you on like where to go and what to do and all of those things for building. Okay. So you, you have a, like an e-com or a, um, a sales page that you can build that direction there as well too? Absolutely. Like, like that's what I'm telling you. Like it, it does all of it. So let me actually show the back end. So this part that I'm showing is part of Action Era's platform. Okay. So like this is the go high level part of Action Era. And on the go high level part, so again, as I said, there are two portions. There's just go high level part. And there is the, uh, there is the content platform. The content platform is entirely related to your app and your courses and summits. But uh, for example, here in this section of it, you can go build funnels, you can build websites. So you, under funnels, I can go create a new funnel and I can build a sales page here if I want to create. Um, I can go build an entire website. So Keisha has been building Entrepreneurs International Network website by using ActionEra. These are our pages homepage, previous events, upcoming events about us. And um, like I can click on this and I can open the I can open the web. So this is like a website that Keisha has built and you have 100% control over um, like how you want it to look like. This is a, uh, for example, page that Keisha has created for people opting into this webinar where you are on. All of this is built through Action Arrow. Like all, all every single one of these pages are built through Action Era. Okay. And also it shows you the stats. So you don't need to use uh, many other tools. So as you see, like it shows us how many unique clicks it has, how many overall clicks, how many opt-ins we're getting. Um, yeah, it allows you to build blogs, uh, create forms, surveys, allows you to add the chat widget to your system um, and so on and so forth. Yeah. So you don't need to buy another tool. Like, I mean, you may like. I mean, you you may want to buy something that actually doesn't do, uh, so, but so, that would be rare. Um, so, if someone someone's creating courses and they have a learning management system, all of that is in all of that action that does included in Action Era. Uh, no, like included in this one ninety nine a month. That's what I'm telling you. Okay. Yeah, it it allows you to build your course, your summits, your giveaways, your surveys, your quizzes. All of that is within Action Era. Yeah, that's why we call it the ultimate platform for entrepreneurs. It, it's the only true all-in-one platform that's out there. And sometimes like it takes people some time to just realize they're like, oh, so it does that and it does that and it does that. And then like, oh crap, like that's just a lot of things that it does. And they were like, it's just a lot of things. Yeah, so it does all of it. Okay. And the coolest thing is that when you have your own app, Everybody's going to ask you, it's like, oh, how did you build your app? And then you say, well, I'm using Action Era. And so the majority of our clients refer two, three, four, five clients to us, which I mean, with the deal that I'm giving you today, 
you get 50% referral fee for that. So if you're referring to clients, that just makes it free for you. You still pay us, but you will pay you back, right? We'll pay you affiliate fees. So. Hey. Thank you so much, Iman, for that very informative talk. So if anybody else has any more questions, um, you may contact the speaker uh, personally. So uh, Iman, how can people reach out to you personally if they have uh, further questions? Uh, yeah, so uh, you can email me directly at Iman at successroadacademy.com. That's I-M-A-N at successroadacademy.com. I'm gonna put that for you in the chat box as well if anyone has any questions. But it's best uh, that if you are joining Action Era, which I believe actually everyone on the call is joining Action Era, uh, uh, when, if you have a question related to Action Era, to contact support, because it may take me four or five days to respond to an email, but Action Era's support responds immediately. So if you're using Action Era, use Action Era support. They are 10 times faster than me. Awesome. So now we're on our last part of our event our takeaways and gratitude circle. So we highly encourage you to raise your hand if you want to share any takeaways that you had in this event, or if you, have, if you want to give your appreciation to our speaker for today. Can I start with an appreciation myself? Sure. Awesome. So I am very grateful, Keisha, to you for bringing um, Entrepreneurs International Network back. I know how hard you've worked over the last uh, couple of months to organize the events and, and bring people back uh, uh, to this group. I know that this was the first event that we did and um, uh, you rock as uh, as a team member, as, um, as the work that you're doing and as an MC, by the way, you're amazing. So this is the first time I see you MC. Of, of course, this is your first time I'm seeing. So this is the first time I'm seeing you MC. But, um, but you've been amazing. Thank you very much for the awesome work. Also, I want to appreciate everyone who's still on the call. So um, uh, Mary, uh, Kathleen, and Carmine, really appreciate you guys for showing up on the very first comeback events of Entrepreneurs International Network. And we're excited to see more and more events um, run by um, Keisha. Thank you so much, Iman. Well, I also want to share my takeaways um, on uh, your uh, talk. And I have learned a lot, even if I'm not yet an entrepreneur myself. I have seen how a lot of entrepreneurs have worked hard to build their brand and their platform. And I can see that uh, the work that is being done here should really be out there and be seen by people. So I'm really looking forward for... Um, these uh, other entrepreneurs that is here with us as well so that they can also use Actionera to really fortify their businesses. So I'm also thankful for you, Iman. I'm really glad to be here and to learn a lot from you and to the other uh, members of the group. So I'm, I'm really looking forward for all the further events that we'll have. Yeah. So anybody else who would like to share? You may raise your hand. Use the raise hand feature in Zoom. Or you can or... unmute. I see, then, I see that yeah. Kathleen has unmuted. Yes, thank you so much. Yeah, I learned a lot. And you're making such a good point about the app. So I've already downloaded your app, Yvonne. Okay, so I have that. I am extremely new with all of this. Um, so I don't know that I'm ready tonight to make that commitment. But I'm certainly going to keep an eye on you uh, and try to understand better you know, what all of this is. It's all so, so new to me, but I appreciate you guys so much. I am so excited to be a part of this group and I'm going to be looking forward to what's coming next. So thank you. All right. Thank you so very much. Awesome. Thank you, Kathleen. Awesome. Anybody else? We still have a few minutes left. Well, we can finish early. I mean, okay. It's a little fun, no. yeah. Absolutely. No so if anybody else... um. Uh, if there's uh, nobody else who would like to share, I would like to say thank you very much, everyone, for showing up at today's event. Our next event is going to be on June 6th, and that will be still at 4 p.m. Pacific. And we are going to have Virginia Muskies talking in our stage. For the details of the event, we will send you an email a few days from now for you to know all about it, all the details, and that you can 
register on that next event. So once more, thank you so much, everyone. And we will see you on the next one. Take care. Thanks. Take care, everyone.